from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good morning, Penn State. I'm meteorologist Jacob Morris here at your Campus Weather Service Tuesday morning forecast. Taking a live look over Beaver Stadium, beautiful blue skies to start your Tuesday. We're sitting at a current temperature of 64 degrees here in Happy Valley. That dew point is also around 64 degrees, so don't be surprised if you see some fog in the low-lying areas this morning. And it won't feel very comfortable as you're stepping out the door this morning with those high dew points, feeling a little humid uh, this morning as well. It'll be hot and humid again this week. Uh, temperatures around the 90 degree mark and those dew points around 70 degrees. So it'll feel hot and humid, muggy, tropical feel again this week. The good news is that relief is in sight. A weak cold front will arrive on Thursday, uh, decreasing our temperatures rather significantly so that by the weekend, our temperatures will only be in the mid 60s. And I'm sure that's some welcome relief for many people. Taking a current look at your temperatures across the Commonwealth, a little bit warmer to our south and east, 75 in Philadelphia, 73 in Harrisburg, a little bit cooler to our north and west, 62 up in Bradford. And taking a current look at your dew points across the state, feeling rather sticky and humid out there, 74 for a dew point in Philadelphia, 70 for a dew point in Harrisburg. Once you get those dew points above 65, even above 70 degrees, that's when you start to feel that humidity really sink in, tropical feel, oppressive feel and not very comfortable out there. Let's take a look at a future weather model for a little bit later in the day today, around 3.30. 88 degrees here in State College when you factor in both the, uh, the temperatures and the humidity. So make sure you stay well hydrated throughout the day today. As well as for tomorrow, that feels like temperature will be around 94 degrees by the mid-afternoon tomorrow. So it'll feel very hot again tomorrow as well as today. Current radar and satellite over the state, not showing too much in terms of clouds or precipitation, but zooming out more of a national view. We can see this cold front slowly making its way to the east. That's what will provide us with relief a little bit later in the week. We can also see Tropical Storm Gordon sitting and spinning to the west of Florida. And let's go into a few more details about Tropical Storm Gordon. It's currently a tropical storm with winds around 65 miles an hour, and the National Hurricane Center is forecasting it to strengthen to a hurricane before it does make landfall with uh, Louisiana and Mississippi a little bit later in the day today. And then as it moves forward in time, we can see that it'll weaken into a subtropical low by Wednesday over Arkansas. Another uh, system in the Atlantic is Tropical Storm Florence. That's a lot further east in the Atlantic and that won't affect us until later uh, in the week. It might not even make landfall here in the United States. Still a little bit too far out in advance to make that call, but we'll keep monitoring this here at the Campus Weather Service. Switching our focus back to State College, we'll reach a high temperature of 88 degrees to, uh, today with mostly sunny skies. Again, very hot and humid out there. Tonight, we'll drop down to a low of around 68 degrees. Warm, humid, and still feeling very muggy out there tonight under mostly clear skies. Tomorrow, we'll reach a high temperature of around 89 degrees. They'll be near our record high temperature. A record high for uh, tomorrow here in State College is 92 degrees, so we'll be flirting with that record high temperature. Mostly sunny skies again for the day tomorrow. Now, here's your official Campus Weather Service seven-day forecast. By the time we get to Thursday, a few afternoon thunderstorms in our area as that weak cold front makes its way across our region. 86 degrees, still a little bit uh, warm for Thursday. But then by Friday, that temperature will decrease uh, rather significantly, 75 degrees on Friday, few scattered showers possible. By the weekend, those temperatures drop off into the upper 60s, 68 on Saturday, 67 on Sunday with a few showers possible, and then into the mid-70s by the time we get to the beginning part of next week. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm meteorologist Jacob Morris. Have yourselves a great Tuesday.